Hey gang, what you see here are three crates that just arrived from New York. You probably saw my Instagram about it already. I'm so excited! This is a CNC cutting machine. That means we'll be able to cut metal and plastic and wood and uh, that's aluminum and steel. We're going to make all kinds of great new stuff. It's going to be higher quality. And we're now we're going to open these boxes to find the manuals. I've already found one. It's this thick. And there's another 260 pages in here somewhere. Wow. Point being, we're going to follow all the steps and give you a nice little time lapse. And then we're going to get to show you the first cuts and all of that good stuff. So, I want to give a special shout out to Ali, my teacher at BCIT, who is in my lathe class. I want to give a shout out to all my CNC friends on Instagram and uh, New York CNC, who also has a Tormac. You've been a big inspiration to me. Now sit back and enjoy the show. Um, oh, it's sticker time! Sticker time! Where do I put the sticker? Oh, no. I wonder if it's in the instructions. Here's where the sticker is. It would have been nice to have a little label on the outside of the package that said, Open box one, open box two. Yeah. Yeah. You will find the manual in box five.
So the last box just showed up. That's great. It should actually, the, this box here is the bottom of the machine. And then we're gonna have to lift that other piece on top of it with a crane. I don't know what's in the top yet. We're gonna find out and, uh, and stick around. Hey gang, it's May 2nd. I've released the drawer from this side. We're gonna follow the manual very carefully to unbolt this, lift it off the pallet, and move it into its new home over in the corner there. Uh, Uncle Mike, local in Vancouver, came by and mudded up and closed up that whole corner. You may have seen in a previous video, it was still open from the electrical work. So thank you, Uncle Mike. And let's get on with that. Hey gang, we've, uh, we've taken the drawer out of the base. We flipped the base on its side as per the manual. They can said, this. sorry? Can you see this? Yes, we can. Okay. Uh, we're kind of blown out because of the light behind us, but whatever. Uh, they said, take, take photos of any damage you might see. And I don't know how blurry this is, how well you can see it, but paint has been coming off of this part that we just pulled out of the box. So I don't know how they were treated. Maybe they should have been greased before packing, something like that. Uh, I don't think it's a big issue. Uh, more than one of these has this this uh, paint wear on it. In the video, they mentioned an anti-seize compound. Anti-seize. Yeah, so that you could remove it again in the future. But there was nothing uh, in the manual about anti-seize compound. Mm -hmm. These as well, they also have paint flaking off. 